Hello guys, I hope you are all fine. Today we are here to discuss about the program and the program in week week one. Find the maximum, minimum, and mean in the array in both the axes. So let's get the topic here. It will uh, it will store this array in ARR. Then the second line it will store the maximum element uh, in the array, and this one will store the minimum element in the array. Where this one will display the maximum element in the array, this one will display the minimum element in the array. Where here this one, this line it will it will it will store the maximum element of the column, and this one will store the minimum element on the other uh, maximum element in the column, and uh, this one will store the minimum element on the column. Whereas this one also will store the minimum element in the row. And here it will use it is used to display the maximum element in the column. And this will be used to display the maximum in the row. Where here, if you observe this one, this one it will display the minimum element in the column, and it will also display the minimum element in the row. And here it will display the mean of the flattened array. Where this one here, it will display the mean of the array in the row wise. Where this one it will display the mean of the array in the column wise, guys. If you observe this output, the maximum element is twenty one eight one in the. In the array, whereas minimum element is two in the array. If you observe this array, and here ma maximum elements in the column of the array will be eleven eighty one twenty two, whereas maximum elements in the row of the array will be eleven sixteen eighty one, whereas minimum elements will be four two three, and minimum elements will be in the row by these two come four come seven. These are all means, guys. These are all mean values of array. It will be in the flattened array mean, whereas this one will be in the column wise this one is in the row wise guys this is all this is all about this program this is all about this program i hope you understand guys thank you